Hey everyone, Edward Tino Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to fix the error code 0x800-7052 required privilege is not held message on Windows 11 in no time. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to disable the user account control. Now to do this press the Windows button then simply type user account control and then make sure to click on the change user account control settings from the search results. And now in here what you have to do is set the slider to never notify. So this is turned way down, now you can just click on OK, save the changes, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to run an SFC scan. Now to do this press the Windows button then simply type CMD and then run command prompt as an administrator. Now in here in the command prompt window make sure to copy paste the following command that I posted in the description below and then press enter after this command. Now wait a bit until the scan will be finished because it can take a bit of time so don't lose patience. Afterwards just restart your computer and you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another great solution is to run the Windows Update Troubleshooter. To do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon, afterwards click on system on the left pane and then on the right side scroll way down until you find the troubleshoot category, so just click on this section. Now just click on other troubleshooters. And afterwards, the last thing you have to do is select the run button next to Windows Update. Windows will now try to detect any issues and fix them as soon as possible. Then you can just restart your computer and check if the issue is still there. Next in line, another great solution is to modify a registry key. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type Reg Edit and select Registry Editor from the search results. Now in here, in the Registry Editor window, make sure to navigate to the following location. H key local machine, then software, afterwards just scroll way down until you find the Microsoft key so expand it, then go down further and select the Windows key to expand it and expand current version and lastly what you have to do is open up policies and then system. And now what you have to do in here is open up the D word called enable LUA. What you have to do in here in the value data is make sure to type in 0 instead of 1 and then just press on OK to save the changes. Now you can just restart your computer and check if the solution worked properly. And lastly, another useful solution might be to clear the software distribution folder. Now to do this, first of all, we have to go in the Services tab to stop the Windows Update service. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type Services and then select it as an application from the search result. And in here, just scroll down until you find the Windows Update service double click on it and then under the service status if it's set to running just click on the stop button. Now exit this windows and what you have to do next is head over to the following location. Open up an instance of file explorer then go to the C drive scroll down until you find the windows folder and double click on it to open it and then in here scroll down until you find the software distribution folder again expand it or open it and lastly open the download folder. And finally what you have to do in here is select all the folders, press shift and delete and just delete all these items. Now from here on you can just restart your computer and then you can check if the problem still persists. However, as an alternative we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it, super simple, isn't it? Of course, if this video helped you, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.